all right uh welcome back this is minyak today i'm going to show you guys how to install this game using uh well uh tweaker pso tweaker okay i know you guys are angry and i am also a bit uh you know angry but you know in the comment please be civilized and <laughs> direct all angry comment toward uh, you know ms store not to me <laughs> Because on the last video, uh, yeah, I got a lot of flame for MS Store, but you know, I do not work for, uh, I don't work for uh, MS Microsoft, I do not actually work for Sega either, I'm just a gamer like you guys, so we are pretty much in the same boat. Alright, if you like this type of video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe, okay? Alright, so let's begin. So how do you use Tweaker? okay so the first thing you still have to do is well it is a clean install first thing you have to do is still go to the time uh, language and change the region to well change the region to united states and then you still need the update uh, for windows which uh, this game need windows uh, the newest windows pretty much and yeah if you need storage just go to storage and change the location of the well the location of the install well you could look at the my old video <laughs> pretty much so basically the first few step is still related to microsoft windows well microsoft store so after the you change your region then you can search the game for fantasy star online 2 and yeah install the 11 gigabyte okay after the installation complete do not click play you know stop stop right there do not click play and um, but you actually need to go to the uh, arc layer this is the website arc layer well arc layer.com for the tweaker PSO tweaker then download the PSO tweaker then after that you launch a uh, tweaker yeah like right now this is the tweaker that I am using this is the newest uh, version this version 6.1.8 okay so basically you, ju you just install PSO2 from here you now while leaving the 11 gigabyte of the the one on Microsoft Windows alone, but you still need Microsoft Windows, uh, you know, the MS Store version, because the tweaker only bypasses uh, partially, okay, the MS Store. It does not bypass the MS Store. Yeah, it actually bypasses them uh, partially, not not completely bypass uh, PSO, you know, the MS Store. So it bypasses partially so you will need to download again the uh pso2 well you use the tweaker setting put in a separate folder than the one on microsoft uh, store yeah don't don't look for the microsoft store version uh to install this tweaker because if you do that ms store will can the uh, PSOs, well, the PSO folders regularly. And if it has any discrepancy with the files, they will delete it. They will think that the file that is the PSO file on your computer is crap. That's why you need to install the tweaker on a separate folder. And you launch the tweaker pretty much after you update everything launch the tweaker okay operation progress download progress pretty much just follow the tweaker yeah so this is the launcher all you have to do is start the game well this game need xbox live so yeah you still have to sign up for the account if you are not using well still has to be microsoft well there are 
is not actually circumventing the MS store because if you do that uh, there are actually a couple of videos that uh, show you guys that you can actually uh, circumvent the MS store but the problem is you still if you want to purchase AC you still have to go through Microsoft store so if you have different uh, what do you think? different I don't know if you have different uh, username you'll have problem purchasing AC so yeah anyway so this is from the tweaker we'll just click launch yeah and you it will download whatever differences update okay antivirus stuff okay so yeah all right so you still need uh, the Xbox Live account so if you do not have the Xbox Live account uh, yeah it won't work it's actually the Xbox uh, I think a companion application something like that I forgot the name <laughs> Okay. So, yeah after this you will don't ever open Microsoft Store ever again ba basically if they, uh, there are any changes to your file on the MS Store um, yeah it will actually del delete some of the file on the MS Store it's a I think it was a piracy precaution something like that you can change the language setting here uh, yeah if you are actually preferred Japanese okay and start the game it will bring you to the ship if you do not have Xbox Live you will not be able to click start okay anyway okay this is a short video yeah, I hope this one helped more and if you, if you have if you guys have angry comment against uh, Microsoft store yeah okay just could you just just direct it towards the my you know Microsoft store instead of me <laughs> because we are pretty much a uh, player here not I do not exactly work for MS you know Microsoft unless I get paid from them then I will take any of your angry comments but uh, apparently not so yeah anyway uh, this is a short video. Thank you for watching. I hope this helped. Uh, this is Minya signing off.